that we were for the Soviet Focus 3, I think, is massive. It's huge. It's the largest one we've ever delivered. The No Step Back, one of the core things we wanted to cover was, of course, the Soviet Union National Focus Tree. It's one of the last remaining major nations which we haven't touched since release, and we felt this was the time to really do it justice. It's been quite a hectic development because of the sheer size of the focus tree and, and all the content we wanted to add. We usually work here, uh, one person works on uh, the focus tree, but for this we, we needed more people. I forget the exact number of focuses, but it's, uh, it's certainly the biggest we've done. It's a bit over 300, I think, which is by a margin the largest we've ever done. We wanted to give the player a chance to comprehensively play through all manners of content that they would find engaging as a uh, communist. Uh, and we wanted to focus a little bit on the alt history parts, uh, including the restoration of the monarchy and eventually looking into fascism as a potential government option. We tried to give like different options in each path as well, so you can actually do the same basic playthrough, but then change some things in it. So I think there's a lot of variation, so I feel players will actually sort of appreciate that and do different things every time they play it and have a lot of a lot of playing hours with stuff they haven't seen before. The paranoia system is one of my favorite parts of the Soviet focus tree. It really enables you to get an idea for what the atmosphere in the government in the Soviet Union at the time was. There was a lot of paranoia, suspicion floating around, and a lot of this made its way into party politics. So it's a lot of content, a lot of writing, a lot of things for the players to discover. The change is in itself big, but the end result is even bigger, I would say. Uh, we're really looking forward to releasing this as, as part of Hearts of Iron 4. It's something that we've longed for for a long time.